2024 Mercedes-Benz EK SUV First Ride, just maybe Benz's best EV yet. Built in Tuscaloosa, Alabama, the 2024 Mercedes-Benz EK SUV will be the top-selling vehicle built on the company's EVA2 electric vehicle architecture, which also underpins the plush EQS sedan and EQS SUV and the EK sedan. That's because, say Mercedes-Benz insiders, the EK SUV is the all-arounder of the bunch, offering the best combination of performance, interior room, versatility, and comfort. And after a day riding along with engineers in the EK500 SUV and the punchy EK53 AMG SUV, we'd have to agree. The Rundown The entry-level model is the single-motor rear-wheel drive 350+, plus, which boasts 288 horsepower and 417 pounds to foot of torque. The volume seller is likely to be the dual-motor all-wheel drive 354 Matic, which also has 288 horsepower, but pumps out 564 pounds to foot above that is the 504 Matic, which has 402 horsepower and 633 pounds to foot the range topper will be the AMG 53 4 Matic, which makes a muscular 616 horsepower and 701 pounds to foot all are fitted with the 90.6 kilowatt hour battery pack used in the EK sedan. The 350 plus is our range hero, says Holger Ensman, project manager of EVA2 development. Claimed range, according to Europe's WLTP test protocol, is 367 miles, although the tougher EPA test is likely to bring that number closer to 300. But the all-wheel drive EK SUVs debut a couple of key range extending technologies that will be extended to the other EVA2 vehicles in coming model year upgrades. The first of these is a mechanical clutch that can decouple or re-engage the front electric motor in 100 milliseconds. The system allows the AWD 4 Matic EK SUVs to drive using only the rear motor under light loads, reducing the drain on the battery, yet be able to switch to all-wheel drive when torque demands from the driver or traction issues on slippery surfaces require it. Additionally, the system allows the front motor to be used on its own during regeneration to send the maximum amount of energy back to the battery. The second technology is a new, much more efficient heat pump that reduces the amount of energy needed from the battery required to run the car's HVAC system. Cranking efficiency up, sound down. These technologies, plus a fully closed underbody, active cooling flaps, and a lot of detailed tuning work in the wind tunnel that has helped reduce the drag coefficient of the EK SUV to a claim 0.25 better than the EQS SUVs and produce WLTP range ratings of 347 miles for the 354 Matic, 340 miles for the 504 Matic, and 292 miles for the more powerful, wider-tired AMG 53. Again, the EPA range numbers will be lower. In addition to improving the efficiency of the EVA2 hardware under the EK SUV skin, Mercedes engineers have spent a lot of time reducing its noise levels. Sound deadening foam now surrounds the motors and is used in cavities, such as the A pillars, in the body structure. The inverter cover is made of a three layer metal and plastic sandwich.